Let's take a look at tank container heating. This is necessary when transporting products, which are products that are particularly thick or even solidify at lower temperatures. It is done by carefully heating the tank container's interior to an appropriate temperature for the specific product. Heating takes place in specially designed heating bays at tank container depots. This process is conducted with great care and sensitivity to ensure the product is not damaged. Before we begin, we confirm details with the customer to determine the optimal temperature range and most appropriate heating method. Depending on the type of product, tank containers are heated using either steam, hot water, or electricity. Steam or hot water is used in the case of products which need to be made more fluid to discharge them at the end of their journey. High temperature steam is the most fuel and energy efficient method. Heating by hot water is slower, but is more suitable for products that are sensitive to high contact temperature. Tanks equipped with an electric heating system are used to transport products which must be maintained at specific temperatures throughout their journey. In every case, the internal temperature is automatically measured and monitored by our advanced systems to ensure every product is safely heated in a way which will not compromise its quality. As an additional safety precaution, we at Stolt Tank Containers double-check the tank's integral thermometer gauge reading against an auto temperature control probe that is inserted into the cargo through the airline valve. In case of food products or dangerous goods, we might use alternative second temperature reading. However long the journey, whatever the circumstances, our expertly planned and executed heating process makes sure each tank container's contents are always delivered in perfect condition. To learn more about Stolt Tank Containers and how we fulfill our customers' needs, go to stulttankcontainers.com.